Hey guys, hope you're doing well. It's Dennis with Dylan. I'm going to take you through a warm up routine that you can do. This will be around five minutes long. This will be covering the ground strokes, the volleys, the smashes, return of serve, and most importantly, the serve. Hope you guys enjoy the video. The importance of the warm up is to increase your body temperature so that your muscles become more pliable, therefore, stretchy and elasticity will help you to be more flexible when moving around the tennis court. I recommend a off court warm up to start. This is with bands, this is also with various other equipment that you can do in order to give yourself the best state to warm up gradually. You wanna start at a slow, gradual pace and then building up. I have a video just here of my off-court warm-up too. This is my on-court warm-up today and I'm gonna show you and take you through that now. When you start warming up, you wanna start with feel. Starting in the service box is a great way to get your control and then you start to move back to the baseline. Just as I'm starting here when warming up, I'm making sure I'm light on my toes, split stepping, and preparing my racket with the early preparation. And this to helps me to time the feel for the session ahead. The side angle view is a great way to check out my court position as well as my racket preparation and how I load with my legs. The importance when warming up is focusing on your contact point and making clean, good quality strikes. It's also very important to focus on keeping your head nice and still and also having a wide triangle base so your feet are at the two bases at the bottom and your head is at the top where your body stays nice and balanced when warming up. Now it's time for some volleys, making sure that I am pushing through my volleys, keeping the racket head high at the starting position and making sure I always remain back to the central neutral position when volleying. And we've played a little nice few points here at the net as well just to get my reactions going too. Finishing my volleys with the overheads. And this is very important with the overheads to make sure that you're staying sideways on and you're preparing your racket with your offhand as you are also using the offhand when pointing and tracking the ball for the smash. This is a great way to also prepare you for when you start your serves. And it's a nice way to also gather a little bit of confidence on your overheads. An important thing to highlight when warming up your serve is to focus on the ball toss and the nice fluent flowing action when serving. So as you can see, my ball toss goes up first, followed by my racket motion. As I gradually start to warm up my serve, I'll start to use my legs to gradually increase the power. Therefore, I'll be able to prepare myself best for when I'm training or playing matches. The return of serve is the second most important shot in tennis and you should definitely focus on this bit as well. Focusing on the first serve and second serve returns, what I'm trying to focus on here right now is aiming deep middle. This is for a big target zone and also I'm trying to focus on the depth of my returns. I just hit a quality shot there and focusing again on another return, trying to get my eye in with that nice return. And finally, I ended my session with hitting the ball down the center of the court with a little bit more intensity. This is more similar to how I would play in a match situation. And this is before I started playing points. And this is a great way to finish your warm up so that you are in a full sweat and feeling great for the matches or training ahead. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.